Hi there students. In this video I want to look at some strange words, all of which come from Gulliver's Travels by Jonathan Swift. Okay, the first one is Brobdingnagian. Brobdingnagian. This means enormous, enormously large, much bigger than usual. The next one I want to look at is um, Struldbrugian. Struldbrugian. Um, and this is an adjective uh, talking about something that is has lasted for very, very many years. It's extremely ancient, but it's lived beyond the point where it shouldn't exist anymore. The other, the next word I want to look at is a yahoo as a noun. A yahoo is a brute, is somebody who um, doesn't think about what they're, what they're doing. It's a rough, coarse person, somebody who's uneducated. They're uncouth, they're a lout, they're a, uh, uh, a bit of a yokel. And the final word is um, whimim. whimim. Um, this, this one, I think, is probably not, it's not possible to use except in context. So the Winims were a race of horse of horse-like people who were extremely um, civilized. So let's go back to the beginning. Okay, Gulliver's Travels. I'm sure most of you know about the book Gulliver Travels. Gulliver's Travels, and you all know about the first part where Gulliver um, is washed ashore on a strange land which is called Lilliput or Lilliput and it's full of Lilliputians tiny little people so we have this adjective Lilliputian meaning extremely small okay so um, uh, the amount of money uh, that I spend is Lilliputian compared to the amount of money that the government spends for example very small and that I have got a video on. So, Brobdingnagian. Okay, now, if you continue to read Gulliver's Travels, he goes to visit many other places. And one of these is Brobdingnag. And this is the land of giants. So, we can use this word bro Brobdingnagian to talk about something that is much, much larger than normal. So, um, they have spent Brobdingnagian quantities of money on this problem, yeah? They have spent huge amounts, um, the, they have spent enormous amounts, gigantic, big, enormous, huge. Um, it looks like you have a Brobdingnagian problem. Yeah, um, I owe uh, a Brobdingnagian sum to, of money to the bank. Okay, so enormous, huge, being of tremendous size. Yeah, okay, now the next one, e a Yahoo. Well, I'm sure you all know Yahoo.com. Um, but a Yahoo... This was first coined by Jonathan Swift in Gulliver's Travels. Um, the Yahoos were a race of brutes, a, bra a race of coarse, uh, uncivilized people who uh, ruled the country where the uh, Winims lived. The Winims were the, uh, the intelligent, horse-like people. And the Yahoos were great big brutes. Um, and that's where th this idea of a, a Yahoo, a yokel, a lout, a bother boy, um, somebody with no taste, came from. Um, I think also, though, maybe we have this word, Yahoo, I've won. And I'm not sure if the two are linked or not. But maybe your uncouth Yahoo just go Yahoo and does what he wants to do. 
Um, I'd be interested in your views on that. Okay, and then finally, the Strulbrugians, or he visits a um, a place where um, he visits Str Struldbrug, Struldbrug, and this is the this is a, um, the name of a race of people who are immortal, but they continue to age. They get older and older. They're declared legally dead at the age of 80, but they don't die because they're immortal and they continue to live. And therefore, from this, we can use this word um, Struldbrugian um, to talk about something that it continues to exist. It's extremely ancient. It's immortal. Um, and it's gone on past the point at which it should have disappeared. <clears throat> so, I don't know, I think if you look at the British legal code, there are still some Struldbrugian laws that exist from the Middle Ages. Or, um, okay, so, um, his Struldbrugian ideas are something that need to change. Yeah, this is something that has been around for ages. Um, the Struldbrugian uh, um, uncivilized uh, traditions have gone on forever. So you can use it for something that has lived for ages, but it's has existed for ages, but it's really no longer relevant or valid. Yeah, it's just like the people senile. Okay, so let's just go through these again. Um, Brobdingnagian, enormous, okay? A Brobdingnagian problem. Um, a Yahoo, okay? Somebody who is uncivilized, yeah? They're just a brute, yeah? For a load of brutes. And then you've got Lilliputian as well, very small. And... Um, Struldbrugian or Struldbrugian, something that is obsolete that has existed forever. And then finally, the Winims, this is just a race of um, very civilized horse like creatures. So, enough. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you soon. Bye for now. Brobdingnagian. Uh, Lilliputian, a Yahoo, um, Struldbrugian, and the Huynims. Bye for now.